Michael, what's the past week been like for you? Past week been uh, it's been exciting. You know, I've been definitely grateful to be a part of New York Jets. Uh, ready to get to work, man. Loving the New Jersey. When the phone did ring, mm. and it was the Jets. Yeah. What was that conversation like? What was the moment like? I felt grateful. That's that's the word. Some people say, were you excited? Were you happy? I think I was grateful for the opportunity and excited to come and tribute to this team. You say you're grateful. What yes. are you most thankful for? I get to do what I love to do at the highest level. I've always dreamed of doing since I was a kid. I set my mind and my goals and every resource that I had up until this point directed at this 15 years of work that I've put in to get to this level. So to get that call for someone to say, yes, we'd like to give you the opportunity to not only continue doing what you love to do, but to come play at the highest level and come help us out. And I get to do that. Can you talk about your development at a &M? Yeah, so whenever I got to a and I that was really my second year playing defense. I played one year at junior college, and then I was recruited to play at A&M. So even going to A&M, being in Kyle Field, that was like, whoa. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was always watching on TV, and now that I was out there, it was it was mind blowing for me. But my development got better as a defensive player, as a defensive end, and as I continue to get better, I was like, yeah. It's, it's definitely reality for me. What really clicked for you last year as far as the tackles for loss, the sacks, the tackles? I'll just say mental preparation, you know, learning to prepare. You know, and when, once you get to a certain level, you can't just show up and play football. You can't just show up and think you're going to just dominate everybody. Everybody's good. Everybody's big. Everybody's strong. Everybody's fast. So what separates people then? Your mind. So for me, it was learning how to mentally prepare and get myself ready to go play. What's the mentality you got to have on the field to be successful? My mentality is that I'm going to give everything that I have to it. Every play. I'm going to be as fast as I can, as violent as I can, as mean as I can be. And do it with as much passion as I can because I love this game. And with that right there, that formula, I'm confident in myself every day. Why is this the right system for you? That, that's something that stood out to me, the way the Jets have talked about you. It's like, hey, this guy's going to be perfect for a system. Yes, I believe that. And that was another part. That was another reason I was grateful that I was drafted to a team that not only I'm perfect for what they do, they're perfect for what I do. You know what I mean? This defense, this attack style defense is, when you, I think when you look at my film and you evaluate me, it's like, that's what I do. You know what I mean? I come down here, I strike people, I attack people, get off the ball, go, high effort. Like everything that they would, everything that this defense is, is what I do. If you had a message to the Jets fans as you embark on your NFL career, what would it be? Man, let's rock and roll. That's what it is, man. Let's rock and roll. I'm ready to go. Um, over the, they know whenever I line up and play, like that dude, He's giving it everything that he got for this, for this green, white, New Jersey, everything. For sure. Appreciate your time. Thank you.